Hey, welcome back to some more Earthbound. In the last episode, we left Dungeon Man uh, in a yellow submarine, and now here we are in the deepest darkness. So, we're gonna go ahead and start exploring. Monkeys run the in. Ah, oh, right. I swear it doesn't smell like monkeys. Alright. Alright, let's try and. Oh, okay, there we go. Let's see. Uh, no status, it just hurts us, unfortunately. Alright, let's get to the land ish part. Ooh! Combat yo yo, super bomb, multi bottle rocket, and the rust promoted deluxe. And. Did Jeff have anything he wanted to sell? Yeah, the laser gun, at least. Nope, never mind. Uh... Alrighty. Well, let's continue through. 18, 191, 234. Or 16, 189, 234. So, yeah. It's only a little bit of damage each time, but. Yeah. Ah, fuck yeah, banana. Uh, is this the point where we use the Hawkeye? Hell yeah! Quite. I look very important, but I'm not really. I'm a cash dispenser man. You want to withdraw cash? I charge you a handling fee, which is the same amount as your withdrawal. So, you want to withdraw? No. I'll be here, so come back anytime. Okay. Well, I'll keep him in mind. Ooh. Our first enemy in the deep darkness. Deepest. Deepest darkness, sorry. The Pitbull Slug. And we're done. Uh, was this where we were before? Or is this unrelated? Looks to be unrelated. I think these shallow ends are safe. It's mostly the thicker stuff that hurts us. Hard Crocodile. That's certainly a title. Oof. That's a lot of damage to that plush bear. Well, it's now 48. Whoa, PP up by 13. That is great. It does rock. Hell yeah. Um, it's a tricky thing where it's like, oh, oh shit, that's the uh, helicopter that Pokey was using. Beef jerky. I assume there's going to be a monkey at some point who asks for a banana, right? That, that just feels like a logical thing. Oh. Taking it instantaneously, I'm a photographic genius for DC Sam himself. I can't get ready for an instant memory. Go to camera, ready, save, fuzzy pickles. Great photograph. Let's remake the fondness of memories. Can we? Village tenders. Comes nobody. Far, it's because. Queek. Thank you. Settings. It. A backup thing for my computer. Alright. No, thank you. <laughs> Sorry about that. Alright, so no one visits Village Tender because it's far, is, I guess, the message from that. IQ Capsule. Ooh. Uh, I'm gonna give that to Jeff because I believe... Forgot about that. Alright. Uh, what can Jeff pawn off? 
let's give the secret herb to Paula for the moment. Even though she's already got one. Oh wait, I can just use... Ah oh, well. Still probably for the best that I actually keep Jeff with a uh, free inventory slot. We fighting? No, we got stuck on that little plot. I think down here there was a different path that I imagine is the way to go. Or maybe I'm completely wrong. Maybe this is just a dead end. Either way, I want to explore it. Nope, this seems to be the right way to go. Or at least to check out this helicopter it is. Completely broken. Thought I could fix it, but on re-examination, I know there's no engine. Hmm. Interesting. Ooh. We got a couple of bugs here. Nah, the pit bull slugs. I wish I had a generic heal all attack. Uh, oh no, there's the plush bear gone. Not too much damage from these guys. Much like the, uh... The swamp water. It's not really dangerous in and of itself. It's more that... It's gonna wear us down quite a bit fighting all these little guys. We soften us up for the big enemies, unfortunately. A cup of life noodles. Hey, let me read that out actually. Hang on. Recipe for making beet jerky. Take some type of meat, slice it into pieces about a half an inch thick, and piece on a laundry line or something like it, and leave it on, out in the sun for maybe six months. Well, that's what my recipe says. We need to recover about 150 health. What the fuck? All right. And the soup uh, did 120, 80. Or well, hang on. I'm a little worried. Uh, about 50. About 30. About 20. I guess that's fine. Hostile Elder Oak. Is this going to be like the other one where the second it's dead it explodes? And does a ton of damage to everyone? Maybe I should be using the, uh... Whatchamacallit? The uh, bazooka. A uh, viper. Great. Oh, we got the jump on him. The manly fish in its cohort. Even slimy at little pile. And manly fish. With quite the funky background. I'm a little worried about Paula's health, but... Uh, for now it's okay. Jab of a spear, 22 damage. Alright, Paula will get a heal after this fight. Might get her to eat the, um... Salam soup. Whose name I can't remember. Molokea. That does about 80, I believe. Which is about how much Paula needed, really. Alright, let's, uh... Attempt to wander through here... As efficiently as we can. Phew! Alright, we got like a vile plume or something. What are we dealing with here? The demonic petunia. There we go. My A button seems to be going a bit, getting a bit louder lately. I bought some nice, um, cheap SNES controllers off of, uh, I think just like eBay or whatever. Um, and they've been pretty good so far, but I think the more that they start to wear the buttons are again, the teensy is a bit weird, I guess, for lack of a better word. 
Oh, could I have just... I just went, like, completely the wrong way, huh? Uh... Let's try out this heavy bazooka, because I believe it said multiple uses. 300 damage. When it says multiple uses, does that mean it uses as much as you want, or does it mean you can only use it so many times? I'm gonna assume so many times. Souvenir coin. Uh. Oh, that count is. Ah, uh, here we go. Ooh, way better. Um. But this other increases your defense and luck. And the um. Well, with the talisman ribbon, I don't want to give that up because it's. You know, uh, Paul is the only one that can equip that. Let's see, 144. Okay, I think Jeff will get this. Whip. There we go. He went from having the worst defense to the best. Yeah, okay, I think this... Yeah, I could have just gone to the left there, my bad. Um, should I have kept the jar of fly honey? We're fighting belch lookalikes. Big pile of puke. Wonderful. Ooh. Oh, great. Uh... Let's see, I'm gonna do life up, uh, just alpha on Jeff. And I might get Jeff to use his bazooka. There we go. Okay, I'll just heal out of battle then. Level 56. Whoa, HP up by 26, that's great. All is in level 49. Jeff is now 49. Wow, they're the same level now. That's cool. I love when um, RPGs will make it so, in some way or another, uh, the levels sort of round out, like the experience sort of rounds out with each other to end up keeping everyone the same sort of level. Um, like, games like, you know, like the first Final Fantasy where you have to just sort of, where everyone starts at the same, but if anyone dies, then they're just permanently offset by that much whatever experience they missed out on. I hate that because I always feel pressured to try and keep them all alive just to keep the experience and levels the same. But yeah, so I love when a game either intentionally has everyone offset because then I don't even think about it or or else has some sort of like inbuilt like mechanic I guess to make it so that they all wind up about the same level towards the end anyway. Anyway, I'm gonna rock handy, which I don't remember what that does exactly. You speed? Oh, okay. I'm gonna use that on Jeff, I think. Nice, Jeff's IQ went up. All right, let's find this manly fish. Hell yeah. Another fight done. All his health is kind of low, but it's also like... I can't... It, it's still only like missing like 50. She's only missing like 50 health. So it's not quite enough for me to feel like... I don't like how low it is, but at the same time it's not so much missing that I can... That I feel like it's worth healing yet. Back onto dry land, at least briefly. There wasn't a way up here that I just ignored like a fool, was there? No. But I assume that's what I'm kind of looking for at this point. 
Alright, we've got a couple of things here. Manly fish and the uh, slimy, even slimy little pile. There we go, manly fish is done. And we dodged this guy's attack, so... There we go, got fruit out. I'm scathed. Nice. Um... Jeez, I am a little confused about where to head now. I don't like absently wandering through this for obvious reasons, but... I don't think I have much choice really at the moment. I think... Was this where I came from? Or I think that was lower. That was a lower path, I think, so... Yeah, okay. Uh, I mean, it's like, maybe I should have had the... The, um... Jar of Fly Honey on me. Still got a key to a tower that I haven't used yet. Still not entirely sure what that's for. Let me just give Pola a heal before we go into battle. I've forgotten, but bleh, I'm the return of Belch. I fought you before. Pew! I remember right, Boda. Belch has trained more and has returned much stronger. Bleh. Belch has also changed his name to Puke. Bath, vomit, bath, bath, chuck, chuck. Drown to death and puke. Do you think that's an incredibly masculine taunt to throw at you? <laughs> what? Master Bath attacked. Damn, I should have held on to the jar of fly honey. Alright, let's. Let's pull out all the stops here. Basically poisoned us. Um, what I'm thinking is Ness is going to be on healing duty, so let's start off with healing himself for the uh, however much he's missing. Yeah, beta. I think actually I will stick with. I was going to swap to Alpha because he's only missing over just a little over a hundred, but it's no telling what. Master Bath is gonna do. Uh, uh, let's use one of these big bottle rockets, I think. Body solidified, that's always great. And they poos down from the sky. Poos his new power, PSI Star Storm. Oh, he's like Star Storm Alpha. Yeah, poo! Holy shit! And I left a present. Inside the present, there was a Casey bat. Oh, it took it. And this level's now 57. Oh, this level's now 50. Poor Pooh's now 43, was that say? Oh, damn, he's gotten some levels while he was gone. Fuck yeah, Pooh. Look at that, his offense is 90. Which, considering we don't have a weapon for him yet, that's pretty good. He's like Star Storm, a method of shaking off the stars, which Pooh learned in his training. It deals about 360 points of damage to each enemy. That's pretty good. That was like, oh man. Um, nothing else new, but it looks like that's fine. You got healing, Ome uh, not Omega, Gamma. I remembered this time. It's gonna be as cute as being diamondized and paralysis. It also revives a friend. Oh, I didn't know that. I don't think Ness has. Oh, Ness does. I didn't realize that that revive people. Oops. <laughs> Bildo, hell yeah. Fuck yeah, with Pooh back, we also have. We have our town map back, which is great. Um, let me... I'm just gonna give him a Viper. So that Polar can give him the KC bat so we can find out if that's better or not. I'm gonna assume yes. Oh, that is... Wait. Hang on. That's so much better. That can't come about like a... With this weapon. Can't help but swing this map with all your might. There's a good chance that you may just whiff. Right. Yeah, I remember... 
I remembered something about this. So it's really strong, obviously, but it misses more often than it doesn't. So unfortunately, uh, I am not going to equip that. Alright, let's walk along the shallow end while we can. Some of violence cohort. Now with Poo, we should get through these fights even quicker, which is nice. Yeah, we'll definitely heal Ness after this fight. If Ness doesn't have the most health in the party, then there's something going wrong. <laughs> nice, Jeff gained a level. I'm gonna go for a beta just because it's like 200 health. Um, Jeff doesn't have that much more health he's missing it, does he? Yeah, a bit, but I don't think I need to heal just yet. Squeeze through here. There we go, back to solid land. There's a cave entrance up there. And that does seem to be it. Alright. Into the cave. We're shy. We're shy. junk. Hey, receiver! Uh... I don't know if they can get to us, but I can't have to find out. Death Ray inside! Uh... Let's see... That sounds like something Jeff can equip. So let's find out. Yep. Hell yeah. We're all shy. Rumor. I had a book to fix shyness there is. Where? Don't know. Just a rumor. Oh, let's go express. Louis we charge 18. Give the bill, right? Yes. Alright, so... Start off, this key to a tower, I haven't needed it yet. Oh yeah, uh, and the KC bat. And then... This laser gun, since I can't sell it. I'm thinking, frankly, of just doing another one, because... I don't think we need the Hieroglyph copy anymore. Since we're kind of well past it. I'm gonna do another Chicago Express order. Where's Shay? Alright, let's give a couple more things so we can actually clear up some room here. Um, shield killer, I just never use. I feel like most enemies at this point don't really have shields, or if they do, they're bosses, so it doesn't really work. Alright, here we go, copy. Uh, and I think we're probably good on that, but. Um, I could probably give another side caramel just because probably don't need that many things. Wish I hot sprints. Good all over. Spin, spin, spin. Roland hot sprint healed you. Hell yeah. 
Well, I guess her status is, I guess. Item shop here. I'm shy. <laughs> Too shy to sell me things, apparently. Oh, there's a cool rock. Shy. That we are. There's only one tender who's not shy. It's me, Bubby. You know what? There's something scary that comes from the underground. So we covered up the hole. There lots of dinosaurs there. I went there once, but I came right back, so I was so surprised. There was a talking stone that talks a lot. You want to go and see? I understand, but I'm not as strong as I look. I'm sorry, I guess I can't help you. The guy next to me is strong, but he likes the conversation skills. So we come as shyness first. Alright. Um... Well, I don't know what exactly we do about this shyness. Oh, oh it's been a while since we talked. This is an apple kid. I'm having beautiful weather here. I'm now at Dr. Antonut's lab in Winters. So it doesn't seem to be around right now, but I'm just working on my eraser eraser machine. Oh no, that sound. Hey, oh no, what are you doing to me? Who are you? Click. No, I've told you in ages. This is Orange Kid. We're finally coming near to the end of our research on how to change a boiled egg back into a raw egg. By the way, Apple Kid is missing. He left here saying that he was going to see Dr. Andernuts in Winters, but he never came back. Simon so borrowed the book Overcoming Shyness from him, but suddenly he disappeared. I read the book, so I'm not very good at talking. Sorry. I was working hard on my invention, so I hope you'll understand. Say hello to your friends for me. Click. Alright, sounds like we've got to go rescue them. Alright. So, let's go ahead and do teleport beta. To Winters. Oh, this is what they mean by Winters. Uh, just to check, there wasn't... Yeah, there wasn't exactly a option specifically to the lab, so I guess we have to walk all the way down. Me again, the chewing gum monkey's wife. has left me here to go play with Tessie along the shores of Lake Tess. There was a shop here that we never... That, uh, I think they had some good stuff. T-Rex's bat, not in stick fry pan, coin of silence. Oh, those probably were good back when we could first access here. Uh, unfortunately, now they're not really uh, as good as what we've got. Sorry, the bubblegum is sold out. Go outside. Are we able to go in here? I assume not. Jeff, long time no see. We've gotten taller. Oh, no time to chat right now. Tony's missing. But he was with you. He suddenly disappeared. He's usually very responsible, and leaves a note at least. Alright. Let's head down to the lab. There's a Mook and its cohort, the Whirling Robo. I'm assuming if we were meant to go straight to the lab, they would have given us an option in the teleport. Oh, really? That counted as the back? God damn it. Let's call it's opening attack. Fight a beam, 50 damage to poo, yikes. And freeze alpha. 150 damage? Jesus. Uh, life up beta. Flash, shoot. Uh. Star storm, why not? Let's have fun. <laughs> That's right, Paula's got the thing that reduces damage from that sort of thing. Well, the Shambler disappeared. There we go. 
So I assume the reason Pooh gained so many levels was because we were, uh... I assume he was, like, also gaining the same experience as us. I thought there are many monsters I've never seen before. I wonder what's happening. Just stay here where it's safe. We don't mind if you stay. Why don't I rest here for a short while? Have something to drink. Have some tea? Nice. Got a chance to rest up. I do appreciate the chance to get to play with the winter's music in the background some more. I don't know why, but it's, just, it's one of my favorite tunes in this game. Every time it gets to the part with Jeff, I'm always really hyped, even though my feelings toward Jeff himself are very eh. He's fine. He's good. For another fight. Also, I didn't realize, didn't realize Polar's health is finally over 200. And this looks like a way forward. No, I went the wrong way. It's been a long time since we've been here, so forgive me if I don't exactly remember. Um. I don't really need to stop by every ho everything. Sebastian Chum was kidnapped. So shocking. He's such a great guy. Oh, another picture? We should take it instantaneously. I'll photograph genius if I do so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at your camera. Ready. Say fuzzy pickles. What a great photograph. Let's bring back to fondness of memories. I finally saw Tessie. It's like seeing a UFO. Emerged from the lake and flew towards Stonehenge. Kidnapped one of my friends along the way. That... I don't... Where are you, my friend? I came and took you away. Come back, Sebastian. Hey, that's a haiku poem. Yep, I have some shoe and gum. Oh, we get to do this again? Fuck yeah. God, it's so good. Alright, we have more enemies to face. I just realized I I was just absentmindedly mashing A without thinking. I it didn't even click to me. Oh hey, Jeff probably needs a heal. All right, well we're gonna heal immediately after this. All right, PSI, life up beta, and Jeff, let's go. 
Ow. If I had still had the pencil eraser, I could have just done that. Wasn't there a telephone in here? The signs will still say the same stuff. Yeah. It looks like none of the enemies have stuck around, so... At least it's not going to take much longer to get through here. I do wish I'd kept the pencil eraser on us, though. I did give that up, didn't I? Yeah. Not that I blame me, really. Like, why would I hold on to that? Without knowing ahead of time. Ah, beans. It especially sucks because it's like, we could have come back here any time to deal with that. You know, let me just, uh... Let's see, um... There we go, pencil eraser. Uh, was there anything else? Not really. Just so I don't have to worry about walking through all of that again in the future. I don't know if this will work out here, but here it's worth trying. Yeah, cool. Oh, he can walk through it. God damn, alright. Alright, now we just need to get through here. Oh good, it's all the same old enemies, so... They're all just gonna run away from us, which is nice. Not having to deal with more things. Really? Elder Batty, alright. Oh, okay, these are souped up enemies. Here we go. Well, even if the enemies are actually technically stronger, I don't really want to fight them if I don't have to. Um, is it up that rope? No, I think it was up this rope. Yeah, because that's where the sanctuary was. The, uh, third one, I think? Yeah, third one. Alright, let's just walk around a little bit. Ah, oh, these guys are running from us at this point. And here we are, we finally made it back to Dr. Andonut's lab. I'm waiting for you. My master apple kid completed this eraser eraser machine. While he was calling you, he was kidnapped. He felt like this. I was there, but helpless. Sorry about that. Anyway, take this machine. Got the eraser eraser. Way to go. Alright. Let's use this instant revitalizing device. Alright. I don't know if you remember, but in Stonehenge there was a little cave that had an eraser shaped statue. But that's where we're gonna head next. Uh, but until then, thank you all so much for watching. Yeah, next time we're gonna go and hopefully save Apple Kid and Tony and Sebastian. I assume they're all being kidnapped by the same person. And Dr. Andonuts. Like, there's just a lot of people missing right now. So, thank you all for watching. And we're gonna get to that in the next one. Bye bye.